Hi guys, and welcome back to Twisted Stitches, spooky edition. Ooh. Uh, I am here today because we need to open up the Halloween Advent. I purchased the Beetlejuice Halloween Advent that was being offered by Mason's Creations Yarns. And I've never had a Halloween Advent. It is a 10 day minis Advent. So you're, su you're supposed to start opening it on the 21st and your last day to open is the 31st Halloween day. So um, I forgot. I totally forgot about it, and here I am. Uh, I know it's the 23rd, sorry guys, but we will do the 21st, 22nd, and 23rd in this video, and then I will be on track. <laughs> Woo! Just the time flew by, and it escaped me, and it was sitting in the back of my head, and I was like, what am I supposed to do? <gasps> and a couple days later, I remembered. So, it came in the regular packaging here, let me just show you. As, I'll just show you here a second. It came in packaging just like this in her standard packaging. Um, so there wasn't anything fancy for that. So I did put it in a little, oops, I put it in a little box and put a piece of fabric, you know, sugar skulls fabric to make it look a little bit cuter for the daily unwrappings. So they are numbered one through 10. Um, and we get to open one each day for the next 10 days until Halloween. Woohoo! And Halloween, I mean, just my excuse to be able to wear my skull rings, my skull bracelet, my skull earrings, just because, you know, I like to wear it every day. And it seems like Halloween is the time that it actually fits in for me. So let's open the very first one. Okay, we'll open it together. So here is number one. And this is the Beetle. I did say the Beetlejuice Halloween Advent, didn't I? So let's see what kind of squishy goodness is inside these little packets. Um, I don't know if I said it, but each one of these minis is a 20 gram mini, which on the average, uh, 20 gram minis usually are approximately 80-ish yards, uh, just under 100 yards. So let's see. I believe these were all dyed on 75% superwash merino, 25% nylon, but we will find out. So let's start with number one. You ready? Here we go. And here is number one. So we have some really pretty colors here. We got some reds, pinkish colors, some yellows and tans. Uh, let's see the colorway. The colorway is called Watch Out for the Dog. It's on her workhorse base, which is 75% superwash merino, 25% nylon. I thought it was. It feels really great. So here it is. Watch Out for the Dog. There we go. That is cute. I'm trying to it has some pretty colors in it. Those are some nice colors. So this was day one, which would have been Thursday, the 21st. That's the first day. And that's when I'm supposed to start. So let's do day two, which would have been Friday, the 22nd. You guys ready? Let's take a peek. So from now on, the videos will be uh, a little bit shorter. We'll just come on here and open it up and take a look at the colors. Let's see what we have here. And here we go. Oh, here we go. This is really cool looking. So here is day two, which would have been Friday the 22nd. And this colorway is called Handbook for the Recently Deceased. And it does kind of look like that, doesn't it? It has the colors of that handbook in there. It has the blues, which was in the handbook, and the color of the papers and the people on the front. If you guys remember, Beetlejuice is like one of my like fun favorite movies to watch during any time, but you know, for the Halloween season, definitely. So we did days one and two, which would have been Thursday and Friday, the 21st and the 22nd. Now let's do Saturdays, the 23rd, and then I shall be caught up. <laughs> and then from there on, I should be okay. So, so let's go on to day three. Let's see what colors we have. Oh, look at this, guys. Let's open that up. 
Ooh, look at these colors. I like them. What do you guys think? And remember, these are all on the 75% Superwash Merino, 25% Nylon. They feel nice, soft, and squishy. I really like this color. What is this called? This is called Sandworm. So let's see if you can see that. It's called Sandworm. I like it. I like it a lot. I really like these colors together. They're I really like these colors together. They really play off each other really neatly. These are awesome. Okay, so I'm going to show you all three. So we have the first day, which is watch out for the dog. So if you remember on the bridge, she screams, watch out for the dog. And that's when they go over. So then we have day two, which is handbook for the recently deceased, which they get the handbook and they're supposed to learn about what it's like to be in the, what it's like after you pass on. And then we have Sandworm, which comes into play pretty quickly. So look at how good these three go together. I like them. That is awesome. So tomorrow, which is Sunday the 24th, we will open day four and then I will be putting them together and holding them up together so we can, the best I can. And then eventually I'll have to probably lay it in the box and just have you see it that way. So we have the three days in a row. Do you guys like it? What do you think? And, you know, I told you Beetlejuice is one of my favorites. So is Hocus Pocus. Um, watching some of the scary ones like the original Halloween, stuff like that is always really awesome. I love that stuff for Halloween time. Let me know in the comments what is your favorite Halloween type movie, scary movie, anything, you know, whatever. But uh, do you guys have a favorite movie? If you do, let me know what it is. I would love to hear what your guys' favorite movie is. And then it'll also help bring back memories. So maybe one of you guys will remind me of a movie that I totally forgot about and I could go watch it. So you guys have a wonderful rest of your day. I'll be talking to you really soon like tomorrow and i hope you guys have a wonderful day you guys stay safe stay, you guys stay safe stay healthy and stay creative and be on the lookout for the beetlejuice halloween advent i'll be opening it up every day i'll be talking to you guys really soon love you guys bye